Welcome to the Outer Oval at North Harbour Stadium in Auckland for match day four of the OFC U20 Championships. Uh, it's the first semi-final between Solomon Islands and Vanuatu. Kalatang wins it back for Vanuatu, slips a pass through for Silas Frank. It's a good ball to the oh. six-yard box and a chance for Vanuatu, 1-0. Oh. Eight minutes gone and Vanuatu have taken the lead. It has to go down as a mistake by the keeper, I think, when uh, that ball went into the six-yard box. And Didier Khalid, who hatched the move in midfield with that slaloming run, gets on the end of it. Well, we see here Silas uh, Frank has uh, got on the ball in the flank. He's put in a dangerous delivery across the box, and Saida, a regulation catch, uh, has just dropped it, and uh, Didier uh, has managed to get on the end of that and just knock it into empty goal to try and retain the ball, but you can't fault uh, his attitude. Saloni, uh, air rule. Well, he pushed. Oh. The player over, and it's an easy one for the referee to award a penalty. It's a terrible mistake. A moment of uh, defensive naivety from the goalkeeper, and the Solomon Islands have a massive opportunity to draw level. Well, I think you see two errors here. One, he's failed to take it, and then he's... Uh, to put it in the back of the net and he doesn't it's a great oh, save by a save. the keeper what a save well that collision has uh, allowed oh, it's a great little ball if now it's across for him to later can he get a shot away he can <laughs> and the solomons are level 25 minutes in and it's him to later joy on the solomon islands bench <laughs> Uh, Toledo's turned well. He, he's been able to turn and face up uh, the defender, and he's just moved to the left and got a shot away. Toledo's going uh, to run this down. She will have to. Well, well played by Hinson oh, Toledo. He's done well. Past two challenges. Can he score? He can. He can. 42 minutes in, and it's a double for Toledo. <laughs> and he's punished Kevin Shem and Vanuatu. Receives congratulations from Tutti Tanita. And you see this, I mean, Shem had the ball, he should have cleared it, he's tried to shield it out and it's just been taken off him. Another defender's uh, dived in and he's beaten the keeper at the near post, Gordon. It's uh, Vanuatu 1, Solomon Islands 2. Himson Toledo, Saru dwells on the ball. Doesn't get punished for it. Bad touch from uh, Sarah. Bossor can only clear as far as Khalid. Khalid beats Kinney. There's a shot and a chance oh, and a goal. What a goal. Jean Keltak has leveled it. And the warning signs were there for the Solomon Islands. They failed to clear their lines and Jean Keltak has made it 2 2. And we see great work there from uh, Didier Kalip uh, Gordon. Good ball from Tonito. Oh, and there's problems oh, here. No. It's a goal. And again, Solomon Islands are in the lead. What a big mistake there from uh, between the defender, Brian Kaltak, and the keeper. And that is full time here in the match between uh, Vanuatu and the Solomon Islands. It's going to be an extra 30 minutes. And uh, Vanuatu have uh, clawed their way back into this one. The equaliser from Jean Keltak. Brian Keltak's in no danger. I mean, he should have just taken that ball and cleared it, not waited for the keeper. Baker. Pascal Chabot is uh, marking space. And there's only one back for Vanuatu. It's not a bad ball. It's and in. it's in! <laughs> Unbelievable. It's Kevin Shem. Ah... Uh. Takes us back to uh, Ronaldinho when he scored against Seaman in the World Cup. 2002 <laughs> FIFA World Cup. Was it a shot? Was it a cross? Well, the end result's what matters. And uh, Moise Poiter, the Vanuatu coach, won't be questioning it. Let's take a look at it again. Look at the height wow. on it. I thought it was a great cross of the back post and uh, it's just flew into the top corner. What a goal. I'm sure the likes of Patrick Jacques May would uh, argue that it's perhaps... Uh, 
for the betterment of the game to uh, have protection for goalkeepers. Keepers of which way they're going to put it. Well, Pascal Charbo must score or the Solomon Islands will advance. And uh, who would be in his boots right now? Charbo must score. And he's missed it. It's all over. The Solomon Islands will advance to the final of the OFC U20 Championship. It's a nightmare for Pascal Chabo. It's a nightmare for Vanuatu. But uh, the joy for Solomon Islands, they go to the final of the OFC U20 Championship. You come, you, you, you play so well with your boys. What do you think about the game? Uh, this full game, it's, it's very competitive. And the players, both sides, uh, play very well. And uh, I can only say that uh, um, uh, only um, the team that can play well uh, can uh, win. And uh, uh, taking it from f full 90 minutes to extra time into penalty to shoot out is a very, very, very uh, good performance by both sides and uh, anybody's game. And you're down and then penalty shoot out and then you lost. What, what, what do you think? Upset. I'm, I'm not very happy about the boys, uh, the way we, we play. I'm very happy about the way we play, but uh, uh, the result is no. I want the result. Now, uh, at semi final, we lose. We give away three goals. That's by. Uh, we are punished by our own mistake. So uh, I'm, I'm not happy. Uh, I'm supposed to be in the final now. Uh, Solomon is in the final, so I'm not happy.